drive level. Jackson, look at my stream. Look at my fucking screen. Look at my fucking screen. Right fucking now. No. Look at my fucking screen. We're about to glitch. We're about to glitch. Please. Please. 10 seconds on the clock. I fucking beat it. I fucking beat it. Oh. Sorry. Anyway, where you want me to look at? I fucking beat. Oh, it's what? over. It's over. It's oh. over. It's over. I got the big oily man in there as well. So, what was my reaction? Which like did you actually hear? Uh, what? Look at the Geomshash channel real quick, will you? Oh yeah, the sneak peek. Uh Did Holy you get the I'm, shit. I gotta I'm gonna clutch in there. Yeah. Dude, I think my parents well one of my parents literally just got home as well. <laughs> just in time. Dude, same. One of my parents got home just now. Right as I finished screaming like about big oily men. <laughs> oh, I forgot Better to comment. I'm about to clutch! Holy shit, I'm gonna come. So far, the sneak peek is better than the other one. Too late. Dude, I almost beat it in under 10k attempts. That is actually frightening. I think I like lost my position. Dude, my my reaction was actually so much fucking louder than Bloodbath. It was actually wild. I see you. Well, they do nothing. Oh my god. Honestly, fire level. Pretty Trash. Heat. Kill yourself. Garbage. Fire level. Penis balls. <laughs> So I don't have nearly as much to say about this level as I did about like Karkin or Bloodbath since I beat it way faster than I did for either of them, especially for a second hardest. Anyways, I really enjoyed this level all things considered. It got super consistent and the balancing was decent aside from like the beginning of the drop up to like halfway through the drop which was way harder than like, everything up until some parts in the ending. But it fell into my skill set pretty well and I had been wanting to beat this for a while anyways so I decided I was probably good enough to beat it after Bloodbath.